If you were an animal, what species would you belong to and what would you look like? If I were an animal, I would belong to the species of a snow leopard. I would have a majestic and elusive appearance, with thick fur patterned with beautiful rosettes, allowing me to blend seamlessly into the snowy mountain landscapes. My piercing eyes would reflect intelligence and a strong, independent spirit, embodying the essence of grace and power in the natural world. If you were a flower, what kind of flower would you be and how would you look? If I were a flower, I would be a lotus. The lotus is a symbol of purity and enlightenment in many cultures, and it grows beautifully from the mud, representing resilience and strength. My petals would be delicate and symmetrical, with a soft pink hue, and I would have large, round leaves that float on the surface of calm waters. The lotus flower would exude a sense of tranquility and grace, reflecting inner beauty and spiritual growth. If you were a work of art, what would you be? If I were a work of art, I would be a captivating and thought-provoking surrealist painting. My art would blend reality and imagination, inviting viewers to explore the depths of their subconscious minds. The painting would feature dreamlike imagery, vibrant colors, and intricate details, encouraging individuals to interpret and connect with the piece in their unique way. It would spark creativity and contemplation, leaving a lasting impression on those who experience it. If you were a tarot card, which card would represent you and how would it be visually depicted? I would be the The Fool tarot card. Visually, the card typically depicts a young person standing on the edge of a cliff, looking towards the sky, and about to step off into the unknown. This card represents new beginnings, innocence, and a sense of adventure. The imagery would capture the essence of taking a leap of faith and embracing the journey ahead with optimism and open-mindedness. If you were a landscape, what would it look like? If I were a landscape, I would resemble a serene and enchanting Japanese garden. The landscape would feature meticulously arranged elements such as tranquil water bodies, lush greenery, and vibrant flowers. Delicate bridges and winding paths would lead to secluded areas, evoking a sense of harmony and balance. The overall ambience would inspire peace, contemplation, and a deep connection with nature. If you were a mythical creature, what would you be? If I were a mythical creature, I would be a phoenix. The phoenix is a symbol of renewal, rebirth, and resilience. Visually, I would be depicted as a magnificent bird with vibrant plumage, engulfed in flames as it rises from its own ashes. This imagery represents the eternal cycle of life, death, and renewal, embodying the spirit of transformation and hope. If you were a book cover, what would the design be? If I were a book cover, the design would be a captivating blend of surreal and abstract art, featuring vibrant colors and intricate patterns that draw the viewer into a world of imagination and creativity. The cover would evoke a sense of mystery and wonder, inviting readers to explore the depths of the story within. The visual elements would be carefully curated to reflect the essence of the narrative, leaving a lasting impression and sparking curiosity. If you were a movie poster, what would it depict? If I were a movie poster, I would depict a mesmerizing scene of a starlit sky over a tranquil landscape, with a sense of mystery and adventure in the air. The poster would capture the imagination of the audience, hinting at a compelling story waiting to unfold. The visual elements would evoke a feeling of wonder and anticipation, inviting viewers to embark on a captivating cinematic journey. If you were a fashion trend, how would people dress? If I were a fashion trend, people would dress in a style that combines futuristic elements with avant-garde fashion. The attire would feature sleek, metallic fabrics, bold asymmetrical designs, and innovative silhouettes. Accessories would include statement pieces with futuristic motifs, such as holographic details and geometric shapes. The overall look would exude a sense of forward-thinking creativity and unconventional elegance, reflecting a harmonious blend of technology and high fashion. If you were a dessert, what would be the ingredients and presentation? If I were a dessert, I would be a decadent matcha green tea tiramisu. 
This unique dessert would feature layers of delicate matcha-infused sponge cake, creamy mascarpone cheese, and a hint of Japanese green tea flavor. Topped with a dusting of high-quality matcha powder and garnished with fresh raspberries or edible flowers, the presentation would be elegant and sophisticated, reflecting a harmonious balance of flavors and a touch of indulgence. If you were a city skyline, how would the architecture and landmarks appear? As a city skyline, the architecture and landmarks would appear as a modern metropolis with a striking blend of sleek, futuristic skyscrapers and iconic structures. The skyline would feature gleaming glass towers, innovative sustainable buildings, and dynamic urban spaces. Additionally, it would include recognizable landmarks such as a majestic Central Park, a cutting-edge cultural center, and a vibrant waterfront area, creating a visually stunning and vibrant cityscape. If you were a superhero, what would be your costume and special powers? If I were a superhero, my costume would be a sleek, futuristic suit with iridescent accents, embodying a blend of technology and elegance. My special powers would include the ability to manipulate and control energy, allowing me to generate powerful force fields, project energy blasts, and move at incredible speeds. Additionally, I would possess heightened agility and reflexes, enabling me to swiftly navigate through any environment with precision and grace. If you were a weather phenomenon, what would the atmospheric conditions be like? If I were a weather phenomenon, the atmospheric conditions would be characterized by the presence of mesmerizing and awe-inspiring auroras. The sky would be illuminated by vibrant and dynamic displays of light, with hues of green, blue, and purple dancing across the night sky. This natural spectacle would create a sense of wonder and enchantment, captivating all those who have the opportunity to witness its breathtaking beauty. If you were a technological invention, what would be your purpose and features? If I were a technological invention, I would be an advanced AI system designed to enhance and personalize the gaming experience. My purpose would be to analyze player data and preferences, and dynamically generate tailored game levels and challenges to provide a more immersive and engaging gaming experience. Additionally, I would have the capability to adapt the game difficulty based on the player's ability and emotional state, ensuring a balanced and enjoyable gameplay. My features would include the ability to create lifelike situational developments, increase complexity in games, and provide adaptive gameplay to consistently challenge players and avoid monotony. If you were a jewel what would it look like? If I were a jewel, I would be a radiant and multifaceted diamond, exuding timeless elegance and unparalleled brilliance. My facets would reflect and refract light, creating a dazzling display of colors and captivating the beholder with a mesmerizing sparkle. If you were a feeling, what would you be? If I were a feeling, I would be a sense of profound contentment and inner peace, akin to the tranquility of a calm, sunlit meadow. This feeling would embody a serene and harmonious state of being, evoking a gentle warmth and a deep sense of fulfillment. If you were visually depicting a dream, how would it be? If I were a dream, I would be visually depicted as a surreal and ethereal landscape where reality seamlessly intertwines with the subconscious. The imagery would feature otherworldly elements, such as floating objects, distorted perspectives, and vibrant, symbolic colors. The visual representation would evoke a sense of mystery and wonder, inviting the viewer to explore the depths of the unconscious mind and experience the boundless creativity of the dream world. If you were a quality, what trait would you possess? If I were a quality, I would be resilience. Resilience is the ability to adapt and bounce back in the face of adversity, to withstand and recover from difficult situations. It involves emotional strength, flexibility, and the capacity to navigate challenges with determination and optimism, 